Okay guys, so here we are uh, from the previous video we saw I created a form using the form wizard. So I wanted to just show you a few different ways that we can work with the form in terms of just formatting it and working with it before we really get into how we can change a form and make it do all kinds of crazy things. So the first thing is I am looking at this in form view. That's the standard form view. There it is over there. Form view. Oh, I think it's behind me. Let me just move out of the way. There. Okay, form view and back. Then you can see at the top left hand side, I've got my view button and I can click down here in the drop down arrow. I can say form view, layout view, design view. So let's see what they are. So we're currently in form view. We're used to that one. That's fine. That's where we can actually enter in data into the table through the form. Click over here, layout view. So layout view, like, hmm, not much has changed, but the ribbon changed, and I suddenly have these little highlighted things going around my form uh, fields here, like, you know, everything I click on. I'll show you what that does in a minute. That's very cool. And then we have design view. Design view takes me to the back end of the form. Like, this is what Access actually sees and works with. This is the back end. So we have the, the header of the form is here. The detail is here. The footer is there. All right, you probably saw this in one of the earlier videos when we looked at forms, but uh, yeah, let's switch back to layout, home, view, layout. Right, so why did I go to layout view? Well, layout view is probably one of the easiest ways to format your form in terms of fonts and colors and sizes and all kinds of stuff. So for example, when I click on something like this surname field, if I click on it, I can go to design, arrange and format. If I go format, I'm on format now, and I go and change the color of this, and I choose blue, and I can say bold, and I can make it 12. Do you see what I've done? Okay, I've edited that form field. If you want to do do all of them, okay, I mean, we've got our good, uh, you know, format, pa <coughs> format painter, <coughs> format painter, <coughs> We've got our format painter, and you can then just apply that to all of the others. I think if you just double click, it stays on. There we go. So I'll just go ahead, just using my format painter here. That's another way of doing it. And escape to get rid of that. Or you could go ahead and just click uh, and hold your shift key down. Select everything. Okay, do you see I'm holding my shift key down, clicking on everything. Let go of shift now and change that all in one go. So I could kind of make that red if I wanted to. Red and bold. That's just delicious. Okay. Here we go. I probably would never do that. Although it doesn't look too bad right now. All right. Then I can do things like adjust the length of a field. Okay. There you go. So like that's too I don't need all that space. So I'll just drag it in there. Just, you know, a little bit like that. Maybe make that a little longer. Let's see what else. This one, way too long. Just bring that in there. Do you see what I'm doing, guys? Okay, so it's actually very, very easy in layout mode to format the form with the things that you want to do, like colors and fonts and sizes and stuff like that. So that's actually pretty easy. We could even do things like change the color, but let me show you. Here I am in format. I can do a background image background image to the whole form. Now earlier I'd, I'd already used this image, okay? If you were looking for an image, there's probably, if this is the first time you're doing it, there'll probably be nothing there. So you click on browse. So click on browse, find the image that you're looking for, click on OK, and it's like, holy guacamole, it's there, man, it's there. Now you're probably thinking like, okay, that's a bit intense. And how can we like format this image a little bit? Right, to do this, right, I'm gonna click back on home. I'm gonna to go to my design view here. All right, there we go, so I'm in my design view. And I need to see the properties of my form because that's where we can see where all the various elements are. So I'm gonna go here to the property sheet. There it is there. And at the moment that says form footer, but I don't want form footer, I want the form. There it is there, form. Right, so if I have a look down here, ah, there's my picture. Picture tiling, no. Picture alignment, center. Picture size mode, clip. 
clip is what it's doing now. It's like it's clipped it to fit into there. So I don't like that. It looks awful. So I'm going to change that and we'll make it zoom to the size that it needs to be. That's the original size of the picture. That's the form. Okay, it's not pretty, but you get the idea, all right? If in doubt, right click, properties, form properties form properties and there are all the options there there's your picture options over there so if I have a look in my form view it actually looks like that just it's okay I mean it's not pretty but it's functional and it works but that's how we do a background image in layout view or in a design view okay it's the same thing but it is in the format tab that we do that all right if you wanted to change other things in your form so for example the header over here I could just click on it and select it I can go to design and I can choose themes and colors and fonts if I'm back in format here I can you know fill this with a color this is gonna be just really bad I apologize in advance there we go <laughs> just glorious glorious just pull that all the way across there absolutely beautiful darling yep yep love it love it uh, that's just nasty okay do you see how I uh, adjusted the size of the the head of there I just clicked over there just see how the mouse changes there yes if I go to the bottom I've got nothing in the footer I can make a footer just take my mouse click drag down noise I know I know you can also right click fill background color okay that's just this is getting worse and worse but there you go you get the idea okay format design those are your two tabs you want right click properties or form properties go to layout view as well click go back to layout view where you can actually select things you can even move things check it out I can actually move these around I mean no one in their right mind would do this I'm just demonstrating that you can move things around. Okay, I'm going to stop recording and I'm going to fix this form for the next video.